while Honda recalled another 772 hundred-thousand cars for faulty airbags. You might have missed the U.S. military's drone swarm for intelligence gathering and 3D printed sculptures to blow your mind. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where an artist printed these sculptural forms, then manipulates the light enough with strobes to make the stationary objects look like they're moving. Although any kid can tell you shadows do that too. This episode is presented by Toyota. The all-new Prius Prime Electric Hybrid is more than Toyota's most advanced Prius. With purposeful design, intelligent ecotech, and breakthrough efficiency, it's the new possible. The Department of Defense is doing some surprising bragging about a successful drone swarm test that happened in California with Perdix UAVs. The test actually happened last fall, but we just found out about it now because security. The half-pound foot-long spies flew together to collect intelligence at low-level altitudes. The test used 103 drones, and here's the cool thing, they act together as a hive, but there's no main intelligent base within the swarm. If some are taken out of the lineup, they're simply replaced by other drones. So unlike what Independence Day taught us, killing the queen alien will not drop everything. Well done, Americans. You've learned from your movie elders. And now TLDR, where we to the week's reading for you. Founders from eBay and LinkedIn are backing research into ethical use of artificial intelligence. Volkswagen continues to suffer from its emissions cheating scandal, pleading guilty and now agreeing to pay more than $4 billion to settle the case. The CEO of speaker company Sonos just stepped down amid pressure over competition from the likes of Amazon Echo. Drone company Parrot just laid off nearly 300 employees and dating app Bumble Bumble is introducing disappearing videos to spice up your love life. They are viewable by everyone on the app though, so no crazy ideas. <laughs> 